Want to give your players an interactive map of your server's world that they can explore online? I'm Eric from Shockbyte, and in this video, I'll show you how to make it happen using DynMap. Before we begin, it's useful to know what DynMap actually is. DynMap is a plugin that creates a live, interactive map of your Minecraft server's world. Think of it like Google Maps for Minecraft. It lets you see players' real-time locations, as well as key landmarks across your server. Now, firstly, before the main setup can begin, you'll need to allocate an additional port on your server for the plugin to use. To do so, head to your server's control panel. Then, in the left-hand side menu, locate the Ports tab. Now, under the Additional Ports section, select Add Additional Port, give it a name and short description, then click Add Port. The additional port will now be added, Make a note of the numbers as you'll need them for later. Next, you'll need to install the plugin, so go ahead and stop your server, then head to the Plugins tab at the top of the page, simply search for DynMap, and click Install. When the plugin has been added, go ahead and start your server back up. Now it's installed, we can finally begin the setup process. You'll want to start by heading to the Files tab within your control panel, then navigate to Plugins, DynMap. Locate the file named configuration.txt and click the edit button on the right hand side. In this file, find the line containing def template suffix and change its value to low res. Next, locate the line specifying the web server port setting. This needs to be updated to the port number assigned to your server. Enter the port you configured earlier in this field. When you've finished updating this file, press save to save all changes and exit the text editor. Now, start the server to load the changes you've made. When the server has started, you can visit your server's DynMap page by inputting your server's IP into a browser, then adding a colon and inputting the port you entered earlier and pressing enter. When you first load your server's web page, you might see a completely blank screen, as shown here. This is normal. It occurs because the map images haven't been generated yet. The map will gradually render as players explore the world. If you'd like to generate the entire map immediately, you can use the command slash DynMap full render, either in the console or in-game. Keep in mind, however, that this process can consume a significant amount of your server's RAM and may cause temporary lag spikes. While this is expected behavior, it's not recommended to fully render the map due to potential storage and performance issues. By now, you should be all set to successfully install and set up DynMap on your Minecraft Java Edition server. If you found this tutorial helpful, show your support by liking this video and leaving a comment below. And don't forget to subscribe to Shockbyte for more tutorials on gaming and game server management.